goodness, this is going to be a long day. <laughs> yes, it is. All right. It's my weekly update video and CJ's here so she is going to be hanging out with us today. So we're at a little different angle. We had to move some stuff around and everything so sorry about that if you're offended by it I guess uh, go change videos. Right. Today we're gonna talk a little bit about progress. Um, I don't have any recommended videos right now. I haven't gotten a lot of chance to write stuff or to watch more videos this week uh, which I usually do like on Thursday and Friday. CJ's been here, so we've been catching up on Twin Peaks, because that's super important. We're going to go ahead and uh, just kind of wing it today. So I don't have anything to uh, link you to as far as other AuthorTube videos, but I will definitely get some of those uh, for the next video or so. I edited two paragraphs. That's what I've gotten done this week. Sorry. I, you think you're disappointed. I'm fucking hella disappointed. But that's not the point not the point at all because today is Twin Peaks Day so really the point is Twin Peaks and I'll worry about writing tomorrow. We were looking at some different things that are kind of like going around on AuthorTube and we did see uh, J.D. Archer's uh, Author's Answers uh, series uh, so we kind of wanted to talk about the first one which we um, and in that video he talked about uh, my dream studio or office so uh, I'd like to kind of try that and see kind of what we think of that whole thing. Um, so I guess I'll go ahead and start. Uh, my ideal studio would be, um, I think the biggest difference from what I have right now would be that it wouldn't be where I did anything else. Um, right now it's kind of where I sit all the time. And because um, my, my household is not set up the way a normal household is set up because my husband and I both um, do a lot of other things other than, you know, we don't we don't just work like a nine to five and then go home and, and watch TV with our family and eat dinner and all that jazz. So we don't we don't have a functional dining room as of right now. Um, right now, what's in the dining room is our extra seating and a bunch of bookshelves and like DVDs and our video game system and the TV. Um, which almost never even get turned on because we both video game on our computers. Then we have a living room, but our living room has like a couch and then desks and bookcases. So it's not set up like a living room either. Um, it's not really, we're not really the kind of place that you would like have a party or anything like that. We're not, that's just not set up for that. Um, I stream once a week. My husband streams once a week. I film YouTube videos here. My husband films YouTube videos mostly at the office, but sometimes here. My, we play D&D here, we, you know, it's not set up for what you would call a normal Midwest kind of family life. I think the, the thing that I would change would be having a separate place that was just a writing space would be the biggest change I'd have. Otherwise, I really like the way I have this set up. I like my desk of randomness and stuffs behind me. Um, I like having books around. I like the idea that most of my stuff is at my disposal. Um, I can switch from writing on paper to writing on a computer pretty simply without much trouble. Um, I can switch between activities pretty simply without much trouble. I like all those aspects, but I, would, I wouldn't mind if I had like a separate space for my writing. How about you, CJ? Um, I'm actually in a really awesome position to answer this. My sister and I are moving into a new apartment-ish. Um, in about three weeks. And so one of the things that we've been talking about is living space versus writing space versus bedroom space. Do we want actual desks? Do we want to have desks? Um, one of the things that, that I would really like to create for myself um, is a space that is only used for writing. It would be um, a smaller room lined with bookshelves and then just a small desk that, again, I could either work on the computer or I could work on paper right there. And um, I might have my record player in there because I do like music in the background. Uh, 
but really nothing else. Like, everything would be very focused on the writing. Um, I do require a window. Um, in the place where I live right now, when I moved in eight years ago, we had, um, there was some work done on the house and they added what we refer to as the office in the basement where I live. And I thought this was great. It was going to be this wonderful space. Uh, I could write, I could go in there and I could, you know, create and it would be apart from anything else I had. It was away from my living space. It was away from my bedroom. The problem was that it has no windows. Definitely windows, the bigger windows, the better. Lots of natural light, I like that. So that would be for me. All right, well, we don't have much else to talk about, so I think that's gonna wrap it for today. Um, as I said on Twitter, I'm gonna be probably putting videos out closer to 10 for the rest of the run of Twin Peaks The Return because they moved its time slot up and I watched two episodes in a row and six o'clock is too early for me to actually start like have a video up by like every single Saturday. So counting them by 10 in theory, um, as long as I don't accidentally delete the damn thing like I did last week and have to wait for Travis to re-edit it. He does different editing than I did. So it's You need weird. to teach him to uh, read your mind. Yeah, I'll get right on that. <sighs> anyway, so I guess we'll see you next week. Um, down below you'll find my Twitter, Tumblr, Instagram, Snapchat, and my Patreon. You'll also find links to CJ's stuff down there. Um, and then, uh, as always, Travis's stuff. He did my intro, my outro, um, all that jazz. If you'd like to see the short film that he, uh, adapted from my short story in Suggestion 376 called Taxidermy, that will also be linked down below. Uh, I'll see you guys on Thursday. See you guys on Thursday for my... Um, writing, writing 101 video and then I will see you guys on Friday for the live stream whether CJ wants to show up or not because sometimes she just decides to do whatever the hell she wants CJ had a dinner date with very important people last week that she never told anyone about except herself I thought we had agreed on camera to cancel it I was wrong we did not that never happened no so hopefully next week we'll have a normal live stream with prompts and all that jazz. Um, but for now, we will see you all later. Have a good one and bye. Bye. <laughs>